Aloha nui kako e ka ohana o Iwi TV. Mahalo nui. Ke ia launa ana mai no ke kahi pukana hou aku o Mele Makalihi Wai. Ia mako ko o Iwi TV ma anei Makalihi Wai o ka ele pulu. Me ke ia hoa kipa no ke ia pukana. He hoa pili Maoli no o na pua Greg. Aloha kako. Aloha. Aloha kaua. Mahalo nui. Sis ka hele ana mai nui ko uhau oli ke ia lama mua ko ho'o mau wiki aku he noi ke ia oi. Please introduce these um, handsome gentlemen you've brought with you today. Yes, I'm so <laughs> blessed. Um, not only are they handsome, but they can play a yes, little bit can. too. Yes, they can. Yes, a little bit. Right here, <laughs> playing guitar is Mr. Wailau Ryder. Aloha. And next to him, next to me, next to us. <laughs> <laughs> also on guitar is Zanik Lindsay. Aloha, Zanik. And of course, on bass, we call him Thunder. Yes, we do. Because he brings the thunder. <laughs> Sean Nalei Maila. Aloha, Sean. Aloha. Mahalo again to all of you for um, making the trek to be here, spend some time with us here in Kailua today. Um, Napua, you know, I'm just looking back, thinking about, I went back and looked. Pihana came out in 2008, yeah. Was it around 2007. there? 2007. Seven, eight. Yeah. Okay, and then your second passe de was in 2011-ish. Ish. And here we are in 2018. Girl, you are still crushing it with your Makavalu. Congratulations Mahalo. on that Mahalo. as well. All Nahoku Hano Hano award-winning albums. You have obviously done so much more besides creating beautiful music that we all love. We'll start talking about some of that later on. Um, but here's my first question to you. After all of those years, you've been singing. Of course, we'll talk about the halau in a little bit too. How would you introduce or talk about who Napua Greg is, Keiala? Oh, Keiala and and Maua Mau. I am a Kamau Keia Aina. Um, yeah, a daughter of Hawaii, and um, try to to do not just our lahui, but my kupuna justice in the way we move forward in, in our homeland. Nani, we're gonna talk about some of that again. I mentioned earlier about um, other things that you've been doing that don't have to do with um, himeni, ho'okani, doesn't have, don't have to do with hula, some of the work that you've done in the community just as a public servant. Before we get to that though, I do want to give the shout out and ho'omaika'i nui ya oi ke kumu hula oka halao o na leiko maka uka. Congratulations, you kind of just went in there this past year and plumi it all up and ho'i with overall, Kahiko was Kulana Elua. 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 Yeah. And then Owana Kulana E Kahi. And of course, your beautiful Miss Aloha Hula. And with that, I'm going to ask you to introduce the next song and the beautiful dancer that we have here today. Oh, Ke mahalo Ola. nui. Mahalo nui ya oko. And uh, um, Kanaka o Oivi TV. Uh, the next song we do for you, the beautiful lyrics, the poetry was, was written by Prince Lele Yohoku. But the music was composed by my cousin, Kamakua Lindsay Asing. We, we feature our brand new Miss Aloha Hula of this year, Shalia Kamako Kalani, doing for you Kamala Nai song. Oh, 
Manene mahalo nui ya o ko mahalo ya o e shilia e ko ohana a ole loa e hele a mamau loa o i ai ho o malolo iki ana a ke ho i mai he mau mele a hula ho aku no me na pua. Oh brother, today was so good fun. It was a great day of talking with everyone. But now let's eat some leftovers from your gathering last night. You know the bundled leaves, the dried fish, peppery water, sweet onion, and a little Hawaiian salt. What you wanna do is have the leftovers from ikapone from the big paina with all the dry aku with the poi with the chili pepper water with the mawi onion with the side action of the Hawaiian paakai. That's what you meant to say, right? Without Hawaiian, it's just not the same. Join us by visiting ahapunanaleo.org. He mawala kai, kia i, a po eloea ko ke la me kia lahui a puni kahonua. Ke waku ma Hawaii. Ana ke ia po e makau Hawaii e ho ola, a ho opa a ho i ke kahua o ka ike i ke iau. Hawi ho ana ke. No ka pono o na hanauna e hiki mai ana. E na na aku ia na loea The Masters, he puka ina ho ma o wivi kiwi ke kanela ki ko ho e kolu lua ono. Someone new this time She walked up right beside him Her face did not turn red She looked at him so calmly And this is what she said Good as I was to you Is this the thanks I get For all the years we shared The room got awfully quiet Everybody stared Finally the waiter said Should I bring another chair? She said no, I was just leaving But as she walked out the door She said honey can have 
looking out for number one Did you think it through? Oh, she sure looks good But she won't ever be Eko ohano o Ivi TV, kenana nei no o ko ya mele makalihi vai me koma ko ho a kipa o ke ya la o na poor Greg. Aloha ho mai. Aloha. I am ecstatic that you did that song because I want to talk to you about why you put it on your album um, and even kind of this concept behind Makavalu. Talk to me a little bit about that. Well, I was out of the recording studio for a while. And um, in 2016, well, actually in 2014, I decided I would prepare myself to run for office. And, um, you know, before you run for office, you think, wow, I know a lot of people. Uh, yeah, run for office, then you really know a lot of people. <laughs> because I think all of us, we like to run in our own comfort zones right. with people who think like us and act like us and mm -hmm. want the same things we want. Um, and then you run for office and you learn there's a lot of different people with a lot of different wants and needs. Um, and so it was very interesting for me to run in the community that raised me. And I got a lot of feedback. And some people said stuff like, Napua, like, why run for office? What is the entertainer mm -hmm. going to do about affordable housing? Mm -hmm. Like, you just sing, right? Um, and so I was really disappointed because I ran in my comfort zone with my kumuhula friends and my, mm -hmm. you know, I like to say my smart friends. <laughs> <laughs> right, right. And um, I thought everybody thought, like, I thought, you know, when I see you, I don't just see, like, oh, Amy Kalili on OEV TV. I see uh, a vahinehula. I see a sister, a daughter, a kamehameha mm -hmm. a graduate. I see all different facets to a person and so to hear um well you're just an entertainer yeah. um they didn't see that you know i was a single mom who worked to build a house for my children i was a former state land use commissioner an mm -hmm. international business owner um you know, uh, all around Manavahine, leader of a nonprofit. So you know, an educator, all different things, and so I thought, wow, I think I want to take that Makavalu concept. We use mm -hmm. that to like, um, you know, translate mele and mm -hmm. stuff to look at people mm -hmm. and the different facets, the multi um, facet, faceted, mm -hmm. multifaceted mm -hmm. nature yep, yep. of people, and so. The music on the album reflects the different music that I love, the different parts of me. Good as I was is I love country music. I was raised, born and raised up country Maui. I come from a Paniolo, mm -hmm. um, the Lindsay Ohana from Waimea. And so country music is <laughs> so much a part of, of who we, we are. are. Yep. And, um, and so, you know, I think I wanted to say there's more to me than just this yeah, you know? the, the, to the Hawaiian musician even you know yeah. getting put into that box or the kumuhula you know I wanted to I'm listening to you and I'm thinking about the fact that because you come from this entertainment world and then you're walking into these other places that people may not be kama aina yaoi in that space and place but you arguably have this, I think what a lot of you folks as entertainers do, you have this 
power of celebrity, if you will, and not from a whole kind of kind of um, perspective. It's you're out in the community, you launa a lot with a lot of people. People see you, and I'm just wondering, isn't there a value in that that can be used in these other arenas, politics, if you will, or public service, if you will? Mm -hmm. I definitely think we have um, that ability to reach not just our audience in Hawaii, but mm -hmm. an international audience. Mm -hmm. um, because we do a lot, many of us travel so much. Um, you know, I, when Shalia won and we're doing all these interviews with international magazines and TV uh, networks all over the world, um, I also told her like, it's important to share our message. Yep. And what, what is our platform? What do we think is important? Because not a lot of people are given time or space or, or that visibility to get out a message. Um, you know, we, we dance our hula on top of Mauna Kea and yeah. that video yeah. goes yeah. viral. Um, we speak outside of the courthouse in Maui for Kalei mm -hmm. and that video goes viral. So we have this ability to, to reach mm -hmm. a wider audience and I think uh, more of us should take that opportunity to, to use that to kako'o our lahui and, and have that function for our lahui. Nani lua ole um na po mahalo ya oi no kau mau hana pa ina makeya o ho kani pila he many me kela leo nui loa me loko me okia kino poko vale no nani lua ole ko kau e hana na me kau mau hau mana hula mana anulike ole mahalo nui ya oi eko hano o iv tv he ho o malolo wiki a ke ho i mai he mau mele ho me na pua ma mele makalihi vai.
mahalo nui loa ia o e shalia kamako kalani misa loha hula e lua kaukani umi kumavalu a e ia mako e na kaohana o Iwi TV makalihi vai o ka ele pulu me na pua Greg a me ke ia maukane aloha ho mai kako aloha um since we are kind of on this theme of talking about the multifaceted Napur Greg, especially some of those facets that not all of us are familiar with, I wanted to ask you to talk about this next and last song that you're going to do, what it means to you, and why that also ended up on your, your most recent album. Well, um, like I said, I didn't record for a while. And since my Christmas album and Makavalu, a lot happened between then. And one of the things I think that kind of um, moved my, moved the earth beneath my feet and changed my world was I lost my dad. And so my dad was full Okinawan. So I'm half, the Nakasone. There you go, there you go. She's <laughs> Nakasone. Yes, yes, that's her. <laughs> OG. Um, and so, um, over the years, I've been blessed to be able to travel to Okinawa. And through those travels for music, I was able to meet my family, my, my Nana's family and my Papa's family, like close family, first cousins, um, aunties, uncles. And so, I gained a, a greater understanding and I could see so clearly why they came to Hawaii, why my kupuna came to Hawaii and, and fell in love with this place and felt at home at this place because there are so many similarities in the cultures. Yeah. We go to the Ohana home and the first thing you do is you greet the altar, these are your kupuna so and so, and you say aloha to them and introduce yourself and very Hawaiian. Yep. You know, I mean, it's Okinawan, but Hawaiian. So I was like, wow, I feel like so at home here in Okinawa. And so I wanted to do this song. Um, the, be the lyrics are beautiful. And, it, and um, it shows us through our, like Hawaiian, like our language, through our mele, we can understand the mindset of a people. Same goes for this language. And Okinawa has their own language that's not Japanese. Mm -hmm. Um, just like we have our own language that's not English, that different. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And so it says, it's a song that comes from a parent to a child. Mm -hmm. And it says, you know, it, when the summer sun is blazing and the heat is, is too much for you to take, I will be that pale mm -hmm. and that protection. And I will shade you from that heat and protect you. And when the winter storms come and the snows come and you're chilled to the bone, um, I will also be that protection and keep you warm. And even when I am no longer here, you will be able to feel me in the breeze and and smell me in the scent of that of a puhi. Mm -hmm. You know, it's like so so similar yeah, to us. And um, so. so I was, and I got to actually perform this song with the composer in Okinawa. Oh, so it's yeah. one of my favorites. And so I wanted to record it. Mahalo nui ya mo olalo ana mai and please emele mai no Mahalo nui
na pua Greg. Mahalo nui ya oi ke ya mo. Mi nuke wo holo viki viki koma nova no nui ko ko maha i ka pawana. Mahalo ka mo lalo ana mai ka ai ana mai ya mako i ka ike. Ike ke ya mo au au na ano hi o hi ona like ole o na pua Greg as it were Sean Zanek while au mahalo nui ya o ko ke kai. A pe ya ho i ka mahalo me koma na o aloha ya o ko e ka ohana o iwi TV no ka launa ana mai no ke ya pukana o mele makali hi vai. A e nana mai no ina pukana apau o mele makali hi vai. Ma ko ma ko kanela ki ko ho e helu kolu lua ono a ma o iwi ki ko TV ke kahi. Aloha. Ho kai ho mele. Now. 